Last time on the Group Hardcore Iron Man series, Roydy got a Magma Mutagen, Curtis got a Sarah Doman Hilt, and I, unfortunately, died. As a result of my death, I had to grind a bunch of buckets of sand, and I got level 72 mining. Now, the upside of that is with 72 mining, I can complete the Making Friends with My Arm quest, so that is going to be objective number one for today. Okay, I'm pretty sure the fail rate climbing up this is very, very high. Probably going to be tilted. God damn it! <laughs> I mean, I did say, I, I did, I did know it was gonna happen. Okay, all right, once is enough. That's it, okay. Yep, that I got. I all right. This game sucks. Okay, here we go. Go south, then west, then north. Surely I got this. You just gotta, you just gotta dip, duck, dive, dodge, and dodge. No, you. Rat bastard. Okay, so we've got the wise old man in a coffin right now. Now, I'm being told to attempt to high elk the coffin. You sense the wise old man's disapproval. <laughs> okay, that's pretty good. Alright, sit the fuck down, mother, not my mother, but, you know, the mother troll, yeah, you know. Now they do the Ancient Dance of Love, another fantastic reference by Mod Ash. The E-Dater Dance. And there we go, there is, uh, wait, I like the wordage of that. You have made friends with my arm, very nice, so... I get a bunch of XP off of that, and of course, most importantly, we now have access to Whis and the herb farming patch over there. Uh, and another plus side is I can mine the salt and make the tellies. Uh, I'm assuming I have whatever requirements I need, so I'll probably go mine some salt and uh, put those portals in my POH. Alright, that should be it. This, uh, this whole salt mining thing always takes a lot longer than I think it's going to. I just want to say, if you mined enough salt to make the, uh, the portals in your portal nexus, you're actually a psycho. Alright, let me sip my tea so I can boost up to 50 and make a portal chamber. God, why does it cost 100k? My God, what is my hard-earned gold pieces? Okay, make the teleport focus and make the portal frames whilst I'm at it. Okay, please tell me it's going to allow me to use the basalt noted. Well, it has to, cause I you can't you can't bring a hundred with you unnoted. There's no way. Okay, where's it at? Weiss. Uh huh. And the second one we want. Troll stronghold. Hey, how good is that, man? That's gonna speed up our farm run so much. Now, if only I could actually use this shortcut, but it's still faster. So, after what happened last video, I am putting myself on strict no-Zolra quarantine. But that doesn't matter, because Curtis has been grinding Zolra like a madman. Obviously, now that he has a blowpipe and rigor, his Zolra kills are speeding up like crazy, and so is his luck. Give me the fang! Yes! Sir Visage, boys! Let's fucking go! <laughs> and obviously, what are you going to do with the Serp Helm? More Zolra. Hey, let's go! Holy! The last drop for the farmers. And now we are very, very powerful. And guess what a toxic trident is good for? That's right, more Zolra. Good tank in that kill. Oh, beautiful. With the elite as well. 
So with Curtis's latest installment of Zora, the farmers are now up to two blowpipes, two Serp Helms, and one Magic Fang. Of course, one of those Serp Helms will permanently go to Roydy, because he's going to use that Magma Mutagen on it, which will make it untradeable, but that is totally worth for the flex. Now, if you guys recall last episode, part of my death forfeit was I had to mine a whole bunch of gems while getting 72 mining, and I handed them over to Paul so he could cut them. Well, he got them cut, so I am going to make them into jewelry today. Well, with some cut gems, step number two, of course, is to make some silver bars at the old blast furnace. Well, I threw together a thousand silver... I feel like threw together is not a good description. I made a thousand silver bars, so... Now we gotta start making some bracelets. Oh, baby. So, I got them all put together, and I was about to go runecraft cosmics, but my boy Curtis hooked me up, so... Don't even have to craft the cosmics? Now let's do some enchanting. Oh, baby, there it is. There's the last amulet of chemistry. So we have 236 amulets of chemistry, 169 bracelets of slaughter, and 220 expeditious bracelets. Going in the group for the fellas. Oh no, they've, they've become separated. Oh, they're up there. Let me just, let me just scooch those up there. Well, with all my bracelets and uh, amulets done, I think what I'm going to work on today is construction. My construction level is really lagging behind and I got to get some upgrades for my POH. So I am going to do mahogany homes today, which I've never done before. I'm actually kind of curious to see how it is. Genuinely a really, really simple concept. It's pretty much like Slayer Tasks, uh... It's like, it's like Slayer Tasks except for construction. So, I gotta go fix somebody's house in East Ardoon. So, then you go to their house, you go upstairs, you fix all of the broken stuff in their house, which of course gives you construction XP in the meantime. And there's a level already. There's 50 construction, which means we can now use Teak Plank, so the XP will get even faster. <laughs> yeah, it's... I've been lagging behind pretty bad, so that's why I'm doing that. This today. is... This is big, Jordan. I know. I'm, You've I'm, made it. I'm finally gonna... <laughs> I'm finally gonna get a, get around to making, like, at least, like, some of the pools today or something. Do you need some Teak Planks? I have, like... Well, I have, like, I'm gonna make the logs into about 4k. That should take me pretty far, I think, so. Oh, yeah, that'll be, that'll be some time. Yeah, so I should be good. But, yes, I'm finally upgrading my house today. <laughs> I'm proud of you. Thank you, thank you. Honestly, I need to get on that as well, because I'm behind on construction. We gotta get up to the, at least, like, the 72 pool. Yeah, yeah, that'll be nice. Rather the 81, but from 72. Oh, Roydy's, uh jewelry box for corp last night or the other day was so good so nice oh dude uh yesterday curtis just camped himself inside his house and we were using his ornate pool plus his jewelry box oh. it was really good oh that's amazing yeah well i'm currently up to level 54 construction right now which is a good start but i am all out of teak planks so now i gotta go turn my teak logs into planks which you know of course it's nice we have the poh method uh you know, you can have your butler take him to the, the sawmill and it's nice and fast. The problem is, it's going to cost a lot of money. Okay, last inventory of teak logs. So we got just over 3,800 planks. Bro, my cash stack is so sad. Literally, like, one week ago, I had, like, 7 mil. We are the big poor, man. Uh, but right now, I am level 54 construction. We will see how far these teak planks take us. Okay, I think the reward from this one should get me level 60 construction. Nice little milestone. Sweet. Well, I got a little uh, excessive points without even noticing. We're at 366 points, so I am going to purchase the plank sack. Now, I think the plank sack is, like, pretty nichely useful, but it's apparently very, very good specifically for mahogany homes. So, to my understanding, it works just the way you think it would. Like, you literally just fill it with a bunch of planks. So, that way you have to bank less frequently. Now, how many how many does it hold in total? I'm gonna guess, like, 28, probably. Yeah, okay, so it literally just holds 28 planks. And then, there you go. <laughs> you just bank less frequently. Indeed, there is level 70... Wait, that's 69. Fuck the clip, never mind, my bad. 
Well, I think I'm going to get started on making some of these POH upgrades. Uh, so first and foremost, I'm going to have to make the superior guard, and we're going to have to... We're going to have to move some stuff around here, which is which is fine. We'll figure it out. And then while we're here, we're going to build the rest of... Wait, what did I forget? Oh, five buckets of water. Well, excuse me, game. Okay, I've got my five buckets of water. Now let's slap down the restoration pool and upgrade that to a stamina pool. You can't have noted po... God, this is pissing me off. Please. Let me upgrade my pool now. <laughs> there we go. So this current pool will restore my special attack and my run energy, which is a good start. Well, I don't know how big of an XP drop I get when I hand this in, but I think this is going to be level 75. Maybe? Yes, it is. Give me my cup of tea to celebrate. And there we go. That's pretty much all of my teak planks used up, and that did get me to 75 construction. Well, considering I'm probably done with mahogany homes for a while, I better spend my points. Now, the the construction outfit, really, really expensive. Like, I will literally never get the full set, so I'm not going to bother with individual pieces. The equipable saw, not all that good either, because... I mean, I, like, I wear a staff when I do mahogany homes. I'm just going to buy the supply crates. Uh, now, to my understanding, I think most of the time... Oh, you they, they're not... No, you're trolling me. I think they give you, eh, like, some planks, but mostly soft clay, which I'm fine with, because I can use the clay to make tabs. Yeah, okay, 186 soft clay, some steel bars. Wow, that's actually way worse rewards than I thought. Holy shit. <laughs> it's better than nothing, but barely. Wow, that's terrible. Well, getting 75 construction definitely was a lot of mahogany homes, so I was in the mood for some PVM. Uh, Curtis was gone that day, so Paul, Roy, and I headed off to do some bandos. I'm sorry, Jordan, do you have a Man, cat have with a you? Cat? <laughs> <laughs> Why is he not responding? <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't want to answer this for okay, some reason. Okay, so I'm I'm really, really stupid. Here's what happened. I want to make my cat overgrown to make it into a Wily. So I was like, oh, I'll uh -huh. just bring it with. No problem. But then I just realized I haven't even done the quest yet, so I actually need to stop it before <laughs> it gets overgrown now. Oh, gosh. I mean, you could get a new kitten and then do the quest with the kitten and keep the overgrown. True, Or you can yeah. keep the overgrown and get a new cat by raising it. True. Now that's a pattern with some chest hair. <laughs> yes. Ring yes. around the posy. I've always wanted Paul's sandwich in between us. It's finally out. Oh. I'm sorry, what now? <laughs> Too far. Telling Robin. Too far, baby. Uh, okay. Not what we want. Oh, that's good gosh, yeah. sword shard too, man. I still need that shit on my main. I keep getting. Them. <laughs> you know, it's it's better than nothing. The more shards, the more full blades we'll have someday. It's shit. Fair enough. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, you're, you're being too optimistic there. I had to even it out. <laughs> well, unfortunately, the god sword shard too was all we got. It was not a very long trip of bandos, but. It was nice to take a little break from construction and do some bossing. Uh, Thank well, you. We like PBM. tanking as usual, Mammal? Absolutely. My pleasure. Sorry I got you beat up that one time. My bad. I was cheering you on. Well, good trip, gentlemen. Another yeah, good run. Good run. God's short another God's short shard to the stack. Jordan, can I just say your YouTube series is fantastic, dude? Well, thank you. That's very kind of you. I'm I'm still like two weeks out, so the, the the videos are not caught up, but I'm working on it. Uh, it's exemplary content, man. Keep it rolling. I appreciate that. It's the, the people seem to uh, really enjoy. Literally, the more clips of us just BSing, the better. Pretty much. <laughs> Fair. Has Curtis still been doing Zora? I think he's like one of the one of the half days out from getting his 1,000 KC. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna have to stopping point. 
I suppose I'm just gonna have to chuck these recoil ring charges so I can put the ring back in. I did not think of that. Yeah, did you put too many in? Uh, I think I put like 20 rings in, which is fine. That's no big deal. Yeah, we'll live. We'll live. Well, like I mentioned at the start of that Bandos trip, I wanted to grow my cat into an overgrown cat. The reason why is I need to turn it into a wily cat so I can get some spicy stews. I got 75 construction earlier, so now I need to boost up with spicy stews to a, I think I need to get to like 80 so I can build the achievement gallery, and then I can make my very first jewelry box. But yeah, to get a wily cat, that means I have to do rat catchers. Yay, everybody's favorite quest. It really is. What? I, I, uh, that's so unfair! All I did was go up the thing, he just camp and must spawn, bro, what? That's, that's fucked up. It is done, hello Felcrash, please, let me finish the Rat Catcher's quest. Got a little bit of thieving XP off of that, but of course, most importantly, we can now get a Wily Cat. But first, I need my regular cat to turn into Overgrown. I think it should be getting pretty close to Overgrown, so... And I don't think there's a way to check, so... Wait, how old are you now? I'm not too old, not too young, I think I'm just right. Yeah, that's very helpful, thank you. Okay, whatever, I'll just, we'll wait and see. Should probably turn building mode on before I start doing this. Okay, preserve is on, and here we go. Oh my, no fucking way. No way! <laughs> First fucking try, bro. There's no actual way I just did that on my first try. Oh my god, okay. Jewelry box, quickly, while I'm at it. What? <gasps> Not the steel bar, no! Oh fuck, hurry up. Uh, hurry. I have preserve odds. Steel bar, I need ten prey pots too. Go! I don't even think I need the plus five to build this stuff, but, you know. Oh, hustle up, Jordan. Jewelry box. There we go. Do I still have it? I do. Upgrade pool. Rejuvenate. Oh my god, that's so good. <laughs> First stew, man. No way. Well, whilst I'm upgrading my POH, I'm gonna go ahead and build one of the Mahogany Demon and Mahogany Eagle Lecterns as well, so I can make my own house and Bones to Peaches tabs so that I need to use Paul's house. And I think that's pretty much gonna be it for house upgrades for me for a while. Of course, when I get my construction up higher, we can upgrade our jewelry box and our pool some more, but damn, this is finally coming together. Finally got some nice amenities. And on that note, I'm gonna go ahead and call it a video. Thank you all very much for watching. I do apologize there wasn't a ton of group PVM in this one, but, you know, obviously there's just some times where our schedules don't align the greatest, so we don't always get to do a ton of bossing together, but we made some pretty good gains on the personal end of our account, so if you guys did enjoy today's video, feel free to leave a like, and I will see you all soon.